Hello, good afternoon. It's Simon at Vans today in Worcester. I'm going to give you a quick video walk around of this 2017 on a 17 plate. It is the legend that is the Toyota Hilux with the 2.4 D4D engine, six speed manual gearbox, and in icon specification. Now, the idea of these videos is to give you a warts and all video walk around. We point out the good bits and the bad bits so you can make an informed decision about your purchase we get an awful lot of customers purchase the vehicle having watched the videos and leave a deposit uh, and either come and collect or get the vehicle delivered out to them so uh, this is i think probably one of the cleanest used toyota hilux we have bought um, it is exceptionally clean and tidy condition. So if you're after one, this is not a used and abused Enterprise X rental model. This is a one owner from new with a full Toyota service history with it. Um, you will see it's got an empty bed in the back of it. There you go. Um, up to you. Uh, whether you want to, we can, uh, it's down to the individual, okay? So if you want a load liner, either under rail load liner or an over rail load liner, then that can be supplied. If you're after a hard top, obviously that can be supplied. If you're after a roller shutter, that can be supplied. Depends on what setup you want. We work with a, a very well-known company for having those fitted. So just uh, get in touch with us and let us know. So as I say, one keeper from new, it is 49,000 miles. This is a Euro 6 vehicle. So it is ULEZ LEZ zone compliant and all the, of the clean air zones compliant, okay? So uh, all good from that point of view. So we're gonna start there on the roof. I've taken a picture of the roof as well. So have a look in the pictures, the 60 odd photos on our website. Roof is in good order. The only thing you could potentially say is just need to go along here with a bit of T-cut and polish cut and polish that lip and just do a couple of minor little touch-ins just on the leading edge of there a very common place on the Hiluxes but we can get that sorted out for you before it goes out the windscreen is in good order with no major stone chips to worry about in fact I can't really see any on there all looking pretty good and then coming down onto your bonnet with the rake of the bonnet on a Hilux they're not particularly well known for chipping up or anything it is in very, very clean condition, as you can see. I'm stood about a meter away from the vehicle at the moment. So yeah, as you can see, there's nothing major on there at all, is there? Coming down to your front grills, those are all looking very clean and tidy as well. No damage, your passenger side headlamp unit, uh, that is in good order as well. Your passenger side front bumper corner, front fog light and front um, headlamp wash, all in good order. There's no uh, bumper scuffs nothing like that and if we look down the side profile of the vehicle from from this angle hopefully you can see there are no dents or dings to point out to you we have a little bit of a loose rubber on the grill there which is on the bonnet they are very common for that to be fair we'll have to just secure that back into place here is one stone chip there on the bonnet okay just spotted that for you uh, driver side headlamp units in good order and the driver side front bumper corner again no scuffing, fog lights all good, etc. We've got a stone chip there, we've got a stone chip there, and a little chip there. Okay, those are all very easily touchable in, so we'll uh, we'll get that sorted out before it goes out the door. If we have a look down the side profile of the vehicle from this angle on the driver's side, again, no major dents or dings to point out to you. Very, very straight and tidy. Your driver's side front wing is in good order. All of your alignment to your panels are as they should be. We have a driver's side factory alloy wheel that's in good condition. It has one little chip on the edge of the wheel there. It does have a Bridgestone jeweler tire, which is in good order as well. Plenty of tire tread depth on there. And if we have a look in your arches, the arches clean and tidy. No signs of any excessive abuse in there at all. Mirror unit with integrated indicators, good and the mirror itself that's all good driver's side door glass is all good with no scratching from it coming up and down and the driver's side door itself the badge is where it should be the uh, handle and locks are good alignment of the panels are good we have one little stone chip or a little touch in there to do but everything aligns as it should 
driver's side rear door again exceptionally clean condition you do have a rear privacy glass on this icon on the back end what we have here is a bit of paint protection film ppf okay on all of your hiluxes you will notice that dirt gets in behind it a pain in the ass that it is it does protect it a little bit up to you if you don't want it on there we can remove it and polish it for you um, but that's up to you isn't it uh, rear door handles in good order alignment on your cab a little stone chip there to touch in for you but the alignment is as it should be your side step is aluminium and that is in good order as well just get down low so you can see you've got factory front and rear mud flaps you've got your factory side al aluminium steps and then your rear tub is in really really tidy condition so uh, rear alloy wheel factory no corrosion, all looking good. Bridgestone tool, the tyre. Again, loads of tyre tread depth on that tyre. Have a look at your top of your rear tub, okay? You know if you wanna pick up how these can get battered and damaged. This is very nice and tidy. Your rear light unit is in good order. Your rear bumper is in good order. No big dents in the back of them. Being an icon, it does get reverse parking camera fitted to it as well, okay? back of the vehicle we have rear tailgate all looking very clean and tidy as well top of the tailgate clean and tidy your chrome bumper and all of the associated plastic step parts are in good condition we have a tow bar with single electrics fitted high level brake light rear camera is just under there oh god damn you have to excuse it i've got a kind of semi-fractured wrist which has no power in it. Um, anyway, back of the tub, as you can see, really clean. You know, inside the rear tub, I would suspect it had some form of load liner in it. It can't be that clean, can it? Um, and I know that some owners can be a little bit tight, and when they buy their new Hilux, they take their load liner out and put it back in their new Hilux rather than pay for a new one. I suspect that may have happened here. I'm not casting any aspersions at all, but I think that may well have happened. As I say, gives us gives a chat to us about the back end of it. We can help you out with how you want it set up, okay? But anyway, as you can see, at least you'll see that there's no corrosion hidden underneath it or anything like that. It's all very tidy. Uh, rear light unit, passenger side's all good. And your rear bumper corner. Oh, we have a little bit of a scuff there on the plastic. I nearly missed that. It isn't significant, which is why I nearly missed it. Looking down the passenger side, again, passenger side rear tub. Look at the top of it almost unmarked isn't it so we have a little bit of a mark there may well have had an overbed liner in it at some stage or something but really easy to set up all right rear tub as you can see there's an overview of your rear tub that's all looking good your rear alloy wheel this side again clean and tidy again another matching bridgestone dual attire i would suggest with the same uh, life in it that you have on the other side arches clean and tidy chassis legs clean and tidy we have fuel filler under here i haven't opened it have i but your fuel fillers behind there again a little bit of dirt in the ppf film on that side rear privacy glass that side rear door passenger side we have one stone chip in it there easily sortable and your rear alum is your side aluminium steps from the factory present and correct all looking nice and tidy looks like it's got a little bit of damage just there on that step it's nothing major there is something there but nothing major passenger front door that's all looking good door glass all good door handles good mirror units integrated indicators mirrors those are all good coming through to your dry, uh, passenger side front wing that's all good what have we got there a little stone chip there look so we need to go around it with a touch-up stick but yeah overall very good uh passenger side front alloy wheel all good bridgestone dual attire so it's got a nice set of four bridgestone jewelers fitted to it that's very good and then inside the vehicle it is again exceptionally clean now this vehicle we've literally had it arrive in we've given it a very quick wash and leather black the tires up and i brought it down here to photograph and video so you can tell it's been looked after can't you door card clean tidy entry sills passenger side rear all good look at this carpet has it ever done 
a hard day's work in its life, I suspect not. Back of the seat, really, really tidy. Headlining, all tidy as well. And then your rear seats, again, rear seat trim, really, really clean and tidy. Doesn't really look as though it's had a hard life whatsoever. And then passenger side front door card, again, pretty clean and tidy, maybe a little bit of a better clean there. Nice bit of piano black trim. We all like a bit of piano black trim, don't we? And then your entry sills this side, all looking good. You know, silly little things. These rust on all of uh, Hilux, um, and those are exceptionally clean condition. Look at your carpet. There is no ingrained dirt. What has this pickup been doing? Um, glove boxes, obviously upper and lower. Um, all of your books are in there, locking wheel nuts are in there. Top of the dashboard, very clean and tidy as well. And then look at your passenger seat. That is again, what am I gonna say? Very clean and tidy. Um, I will show you under the bonnet once we have opened it. But let's just do the driver's side first of all. So your driver's side rear door card again, nice condition. One little mark there, a little mark there, but really all very tidy, isn't it? Again, look at that carpet, back of the seats, rear seats itself, got ISOFIX in the back as well. And then driver's side door card, again, could do with a little bit of a clean there, but we have electric windows, we have electric mirrors, central locking, it has electric folding mirrors as well. Your door shuts are very nice and tidy as well. Your entry sills are in very good condition. A really minor mark here, but these things can get really battered up. You will soon tell if you have a look at the, some of them, how worked they can be. Again, your metals here in really nice condition and carpet and pedal rubbers are all good. Power heat button, headlamp levelers lane departure warning system um, and that is something I forgot on that's got to be your pedestrian crash or something like that hasn't it bonnet pulls under there we'll have a look under there and your fuel release is under there uh, and then we have a nice multi-function steering wheel you have auto lights over here we have wipers over here we have cruise control down here and we have a bit of multi-function going on here Horns on the steering wheel there, airbag. We have DAB, uh, FM and AM. We have Bluetooth telephone and Bluetooth music. And we also have a lovely reverse parking camera as well. Air conditioning, God given right of air conditioning, heated rear windows, air recirculation. We have rear diff lock. We have uh, like a hill descent control, I think, something along those lines. Electronic stability program, a 12 volt power there. We also have a USB power there as well. Six-speed manual gearbox, a little bit of wear on the leather gear knob there, nothing major. And then we have your eco and power modes here. Cup holders all looking clean, down the side of your seats all looking clean and tidy. Armrest is all good, we have storage in the armrest. Oh, we have a little bit of additional, let's have a look. Yeah man, look at that. We have, oh, one of those. Jesus Christ, do we live in France? Anyway. One of them. I thought we had a three pin in there then, but obviously not. Uh, you know, you've got to have your sunglasses holder, haven't you? Um, yeah, there we go. Uh, and then let's have a quick look under the bonnet. We're nearly done. I know I've bored you enough. Opening up the bonnet. And under there, really clean and tidy. Battery, power steering fluid. Coolant, correct colour coolant, no contamination, airbox, brake fluid, top of the engine and everything. Let's have a look just down the sides, you can see. It's a Hilux, isn't it? There's not a lot to worry about with a Hilux, okay? I sell a Hilux, I never see it back until about 10 years later when people decide to shift them on. Hilux buyers tend to, tend to buy and keep, don't they? They're very good at trucks. And there we go. Um, so... One owner from you, 49,000 miles. It is the Icon. Um, it is has a full factory 
or full Toyota service history with it. Have a look at the advert. I will detail what the history is. Uh, it's sat on four Bridgestone jeweler tires. It's very, very clean and tidy truck, okay? Um, 60 to 70 photos of this van are on our website, which is vanstoday.com. We are Vans Today Worcester, based in the centre of the country, offering you nationwide delivery, part exchange and finance. Uh, if you're worried about who you're buying off, check out our reputation online. We have reviews, obviously, on our own website, which is vanstoday.com. But we're also on Google, Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram. Uh, we're on all of those. Check us out. Um, spade to spade. Um, and there we go. Um, I don't think there's much else to say other than, well done. There's 16 minutes of your life you're never going to get back. Uh, but if you are interested in this vehicle, um, I think you will have found a very tidy example in this one. Cheers.